How are we doing? How are we doing? Everybody okay? Okay, good. Now we don't say was dead. That's bad. By saying, hey, my grandmother was dead last year. That's incorrect. You don't say was dead to tell what happened to a person. <coughs> Use was dead in reported speech only. For example, I didn't know that her father was dead. That's okay. Or if you talk about the condition of someone when something else happened. For example, the Joker. Do you remember the Joker? Heath Ledger was dead when his movie The Dark Knight was released in 2007. <clears throat> if you use was dead in a simple sentence, it sounds as though the person was dead in the past, but is not dead now. It's confusing. Say is dead to describe the condition of someone who has died. The proper thing to say was, my grandmother died last year. That would be the proper thing to say. My grandmother was dead last year. It's not funny, but it sounds like she saw me. She came back to life. Now, many people don't like to use the word die or dead. These are very sharp words. When talking about family members or close friends, they prefer to say passed away or passed on. In some cases, we say lost. I lost my grandmother when I was a child. Or is no longer with us. These are softer expressions. Uh, slang expressions can be quite humorous, can be funny, and I do encourage you to learn idioms and expressions. It can help you understand TVs and movies, TV shows and movies. Um, although the humorous can be very, very, how can I say? Homer Simpson has a famous quote. He says, ha ha ha, it's funny because I don't know him, which is kind of true. We, we laugh at death, it's kind of a way of taking away its power. But with personal tragedies, we must not use expressions like this, such as six feet under, or pushing up daisies, or kick the bucket. Now you can learn about these expressions, and like I said, I, I am very passionate about idioms and expressions. Go to deathslang.com, check it out. But avoid using those expressions when speaking with someone that you know, or someone else. That should be enough. Let's take a look.